As nations around the world review their energy consumption mix, they also need to consider the consequences of the choices they make. Japan's plan to release treated radioactive water from the Fukushima nuclear plant is creating a new crisis. A lot of nations are concerned and it is making headlines around the world. China is banning the import of food from 10 Japanese prefectures over safety reasons. Meanwhile, the largest fisheries market in the South Korean capital is stepping up radiation testing. Our next report brings you more details. Before he sells the scallop to customers, Pak Gil-sung is testing it for radiation. As Japan plans to release treated radioactive water from its wrecked Fukushima plant, the food market manager in Seoul, South Korea, says his customers are concerned. He says they've tested their products three times a week since 2014, but are now ramping that up to five. More than a million tons of water that was used to cool Japan's nuclear reactors following the March 2011 tsunami will be released. The plan was approved by the International Atomic Energy Agency this week, despite political controversy and resistance from other nations. Japan's government maintains the process is safe, as it has treated the water. Some stall owners say sales are usually slower in the summer, but customers are more anxious, making it more difficult. This customer says she came to the market to buy sashimi for her husband. She says she might worry once the water is released. But for now, she's buying the fish.